Hi there guys, this is Nikhil from Greedy Tech. In this video, I am going to show you how to quickly root the Mi Pad and install Clockwork Mod Recovery on it. So guys, firstly we need to download two files. One, to root the device and two, to install the custom recovery. So first you need to come to this particular web page. I leave the link to this page in the description area. Simply come to this page and scroll down. And over here you should see the download link. Just in case if you are not able to see the link, it means that you need to log in to this particular website and reply to this thread. And once you do that, you will be able to see this link. Just click on it to download the file. So once that is done, just go to this page. I leave this link in the description too. So once you are here, simply scroll down. And over here, you will be able to find the link to download the recovery. And once you have the two files, simply copy them to any location on MePad. So let me just do that. And once it is done, we can turn off the PC and go to the MePad. So guys, this is the MePad. Let me just quickly show you the files. If you scroll all the way to the bottom, you can see the update file and the clockwork mod file. Now you need to go to stock recovery. For that, I am going to use the updater app. Just give it some time until it checks for updates. And once it is done, you will be able to see this menu button over here. Just click on that and select reboot to recovery and say ok. Guys, earlier I have said that you can place the files anywhere you want, but I just made a mistake. Make sure that you copy those two files into the root folder of the internal storage. That is the place when you directly open the SD card. So guys, now you need to select the language English. And now select the third option that is install update.zip and say yes. And now press the power button again to go back and press the power button again and press the power button again to reboot the system. Now you get these two options because this device has dual boot. Simply select the system one or the one that is latest for you. So guys, now the device is rebooting. So guys, let's swipe right and there we have it, the super user app. And let's check if we have the root permissions or not. So there we have it root permissions for me pad. So guys now to flash the custom recovery, let's open up the file explorer. So guys once you open up the file explorer, select the clockwork mod zip file. Just click on it and select extract here. And then it will be extracted into the internal storage under the folder name called clockwork mod cwm. So in it we will have an image file. Now to flash that recovery, we are going to use an application called Flashify. Let's go to Play Store and install Flashify. Just in case if you don't have the Google Play Store installed, you can simply Google for Flashify APK and you will be able to get the setup file. So guys, it is done installing. So let's open it up. It will ask you for root permissions. There we have it. Simply grant the root permissions. So guys, now select recovery image. And now select choose a file. Now select file explorer. And in the file explorer, select the folder CWM. And finally select the image. And now say yep. Now it will flash the custom recovery and it will ask you to reboot the device. Now simply click reboot now and it will enter the custom recovery. So guys when the custom recovery turns on we will be given these two options and we need to select one of those. And by default, I have the system 1 as the latest OS and the system 2 is just a backup. So I am going with the system 1. So guys, I am able to enter into the system 1 and these are the options that I currently have. So let me just go to advanced. 
so guys this particular custom recovery has the true dual boot support so that's it let's go back so guys in this way we can root the device and flash the clockwork mod on xiaomi mi pad running developer rom just a quick reminder if you are running the global rom then you won't be able to root the device so that's it guys thanks for watching the video if you have any doubts please let me know by commenting below this video and if you found this video to be helpful please give me a thumbs up and share it with your friends and please subscribe to my channel to see more videos just like this